What is happening, y'all? Welcome on back. Let's head on into the castle. The showdown with Titan awaits. Probably gonna fight Kupka, and then it's gonna turn into a fight with Ifrit versus Titan. You'll die by my hand. Anything up here before I go through the big doors? My potion and potion. Have you come to defend your father's throne, Lord Rosfield? <laughs> the Grand Duchy of Rosaria. A realm without a ruler, an army, even a people. A veritable kingdom of dust. Truly, I see no throne to defend. No! Just salt in the wound at this point. Enough of your games, Kupka. Just tell me what you want. Sid's head in a box. Imagine my disappointment when I learned that he met his end at the hand of another. And my relief to learn that you had taken up his thrice damned name. Your master slew Benedicta Harmon and defiled her body. If you choose to bear that murderer's name, then you shall answer for his crimes. The only crimes I shall answer for are my own. Sid did everything in his power to save that woman, though she was long past saving. And so I did what he couldn't. It was me all along, Hugo. It was... you. You... you killed her. I did. Fortunate indeed. I had thought the most I could wish for was to take the life of one he loved, just as he did to me. But it seemed I was wrong. And I shall have my revenge. Shared a dream. I would be the king of the world. She would be my queen. And together, we would rule like the gods we are. But you crushed that dream, ground it into dust. Hear me, Rosfield! You will pay for what you've done. I'll tear you apart with my blood! Bro, you were literally being cucked by Odin. What have you? The entire time, like, what? How many people have you killed? How many dreams have you crushed? You're not the only one who's seen their world fall apart around them. Get no pity from me, Kuka. No pity and no mercy. Now die! Oh. This time you learned what becomes of 
that on because the fight started bro wait hang on no i should be able to put it on right no oh my god that sucks can i hang on i got so into the the cutscenes hold up hold up hold up hold up hold up, hold up. load uh 1606 oh there goes that how long ago was that? I think this is like just before I headed over to him. Yeah, it is. Okay. All right. So let's. I have it. I have on Rook's Gambit here. That's weird. Was this? Oh, okay. So I see what happened. All right. Refund you. Master you. Relearn you. And we're just gonna we're gonna skip the dialogue. Well, I, I, like I said, I find this so funny because like, I promise you, dude, so we. You'll die by my hand. She was one hundred percent getting dicked down by the dude that plays Odin. I mean, while Kuka's like, man, a dick to my love, like, bro, you were the side piece. My man's so upset. He he isn't even concerned with the fact that uh, you know it's just it's sloppy, like. Mm. Oh, look at you, I'm beating you up with her power. How does that feel? You like that? It up. There we go. That worked out. Oh no, it's just on top of it. Damn it. Taking the power. You will die by my hand, Rustfield. My hatred for you is unending. And yielding, let this palace be your grave! What? Oh, shit.
The world has chosen. I am in my element. That's no respect. That's just because we're like. Underground. Yeah. Maximum damage! Okay, I guess I cannot just uh, dodge that one. That stagger gauge down, kick his ass down.
nothing. That's so much money. Earth shard. I'm definitely making a Titan sword after this. I think his arm is gone? Did I just cut his arm off? Or both his hands! Oh, <laughs> bro! Clean, Clive! Oh, lord! Gonna take the powers. Do, 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 do. Now we're tightened, yeah, baby. I got the parries. Do, do, do. We're about to have an icon battle. Mustn't get yourself worked up. Uh, Wait. I think that's Bahamut. Another time, Mythos. No, he knows I'm Mythos. Who the hell is this? And who is Mythos? Active time lore help. That's not gonna tell us who it is. I think that was the dragoon dude. Is that all of them? I think so. Well, Ludus, scum. Who the fuck invited them? Well, Luder. Not that that's the biggest surprise we've had to do. Where did you learn to do that toggle? Oh. I'm telling you. Suit yourself. Gav, we have to find Clive. Right, sorry. <sighs> You missed one. We were worried. So was I. I'm guessing they're gonna save Hugo and just redeploy him as an actual weapon at some point. Just chuck him out of the battlefield. We need Titan. I was so close. If it hadn't been for my gift, I would have finished him. I'm just glad you got out of there alive. I mean, when cutting off arrive? both his hands are pretty good. Right after you went inside. Just when we thought we were shot of Titans, lot. In pile Odins. Not enough of them to worry us, though. No. You didn't see the one who took Kuka away. So, what? You think they came here to save him? I'll be fucked if I know what's going on, but every minute we spend racking our brains, that bastard's getting further away. It's 
So what do we do? We go back to the hideaway. I'm too tired to think. As are you, by the looks of it. And after what Jill's been through. Let's worry about Kupka later, shall we? Aye. All right. Well, give us a chance to solve the riddle of your magic mud, too. Twilight Rose. Well, the map's locked, so let's just head to the hideaway for now. A lot of emphasis on this door. Oh, I guess that's where Jill's at. Of you. You're more of a wreck than this place. Is this what you call taking better care of yourself? No more excuses, your ladyship. I order you to rest. <sighs> Fine. I'll rest. Don't worry, Gav. She's in good hands. But we should have never let her fall into Hugo's. Back when he had some like. The question is... Where is he now? And what the hell were those royalists doing there? Hmm. I was wondering about that all the way home. Otto may have heard something. I'll talk to him. And I'll talk to Tomes. The Lawsman? About what? About your faithful hound for a start. If any four-legged friend's ever done that before, I'm betting Tomes will have read about it. But what I want to know is, what happens afterwards? It's all well and good Toggle saving our asses, but if it costs him what it costs Jill... Right. Let me know if you learn anything. Will do. And you do the same, eh? Jill. Listen to Taya. I will. Thank you. Boats from the Blue. Power of Earth. Clive has claimed a portion of Icon Titan's essence, allowing Titan not only changes the aspect of Clive's magical spells, access to new abilities such as Wind Up, uh, ability details. Titanic block can be used to fend off most incoming attacks. Use the button immediately after a perfectly timed precision block to initiate a devastating counter. Yeah, I do like that. That is quite nice. And I already know I'm gonna use that over uh, over Ramu's. I just don't. I mean, lightning rods, cool, uh, but it's, it's very situational. Very situational. Um, I do have that master, so I guess I could keep that around even if I wanted to play with other stuff. And then uh, judgment bolt's not bad, but yeah, let's uh, for starters at least let's put Titan on. So just based on the. So there's going to be one here. It's going to be three more. Which would be Odin, Bahamut, and I guess Shiva. The only thing we're missing is Leviathan. I'm assuming that's the eighth. Uh, what is the ultimate? That looks sick. So you were considered four and three. You were considered four and two. But you have some AoE component to you. I could pull you over if I need it. Let me, um... Well, no, you know what? Let me, let me like, fully refund this. Because I can always, uh...
I know I like this. This is literally the it's the JoJo timed block. I think those are going to be the ones I want to put on. To be honest, I'm not I'm not using his thing either. The uh, the blind justice. I'm just kind of like, eh, it's not for me. Um, we're gonna do Earth and Fury, and then the counter attack. Got more stuff for me too? Mm, just one. Ox Cry Cliff Rosaria. Ox Cry Cliff. Ox Cry Cliff. Sounds familiar. Is there anything else too? No, I think it's just that one. I think, what are we at? 27 minutes over. Yeah, we're about time to wrap up. Let me get all the notes on this thing now. I'll write it, write it down. Spreading throughout the southern, southern reaches of Rosaria. All right, resembles not with a puddle of strange sludge and beast. Moors and meadows of the region. Okay, so southern Rosaria. Ooze, Ox, Cry, Cliff. All right, and now let's see if we can find that real fast. So, Central Rosaria. Ah, yeah. Oh, stop it. Stop it. I wanted to look around and guess where it is. Hmm. It might just be like right here. So let's just, I know we're like already kind of at time on this episode, but real fast, let's just go take a peek, see if we can find it. Plus that'll give me a chance to show off some of the new stuff we got with Titan. Let's go. Run like the wind. There's a thing about the moors and the bogs. Should be like right around here. But I feel like the town would be too far. Now we're getting up to Ald Hill. Huh. Up the spot right here, wide open area. Straight home now. Hmm. Find it. Oh. Yes, we did. Goopy boy, Flame Prince, rank A. Thirty-eight, huh? <laughs> Multi-hit, pretty solid.
I don't think I'm gonna be able to beat this thing. I mean, at some point, obviously, but uh, yeah, I'm gonna be honest, this thing's uh, eight levels higher than me. But we know where it's at now, so it's the big thing. Which I'm glad we found it, because technically speaking, once it transitions into Ald Hill, I would have been like, oh, no, where it's at. It can't be down there, so very much a fortuitous stumble upon. Um, either way, let's wrap things up here, though. We are going to talk to Otto in the next part and find out where we go. And uh, yeah, hopefully the, the I mean, either way, you know, I got Titan's power, so I'm happy. But hopefully that conclusion does come soon.